Hey everybody, this is Mary. Welcome back to the kitchen. It's summertime, it's mid-July, and fresh produce is going crazy. Yesterday we canned beans, and I've got some beans left over from the canning. I've got about two quarts. So I'm going to show you how my mama makes her green beans. It's two, maybe a little over quarts. In all honesty, I didn't measure them, guys. It's just, it's beans. Who doesn't love green beans? Okay, these happen to be blue lake beans. They've already been uh, washed, the ends taken off of them, and snapped. Okay, I have an onion. I cut it in half, and I cut each half into four pieces. Okay, I have garlic powder. Maybe a half teaspoon or so of garlic powder. A little bit of black pepper. This is up to you, folks. You can always add in your plate, but you can't take out. Okay. Pink Himalayan sea salt. This is the type of salt I use most often. It's got a lot of extra minerals and whatnot in it. And, folks, this is bacon grease. Okay, this is the essential oil of the South. A lot of us savor bacon grease to use as flavoring in other foods. It just gives it that kick it needs. Okay, I've got maybe a tablespoon or so of bacon grease. Okay, I'm gonna put in there. Actually, let's go two tablespoons. Okay, and then I'm gonna put a couple of cups of water. And folks, that's the secret to my mom's beans. But, as you notice, this isn't a regular pot. This is the inside of my Instant Pot. So, put it in my Instant Pot. Make sure that uh, everything is sitting the right way in there, like it should. Put it on there. Make sure that you turn your little knob to pressure or sealing whatever your says. Okay, now the time that my mama cooks hers for is 25 minutes. So guys, that's what I'm doing too. You can turn it just on pressure cook and it's on 25 minutes. Okay, what that's going to do is when that comes up to pressure, it's, it's on now. Okay, when it comes up to pressure, it's going to kick on and show 25 minutes. And then it's going to count down to zero as it cooks. And when it gets done cooking, we're going to let that pressure release naturally on there. And then we have beans, guys. But one major, major point. Never, ever, ever just open the lid on an Instant Pot, a pressure cooker, a pressure canner. Always check that little thing that pops up to make sure that it is down. When it is down, there's no pressure. If it's up and you open it, you've got second and third degree burns. So always, always be careful whenever you open that. Well, thank you Jesus, another relish popped a can earlier today. But I will show you what those beans look like when I'm ready for dinner. Okay, the uh, timer uh, went off on air, instant hot on their green beans. The pressure dropped naturally. And folks, this to me looks like a absolutely fantastic dinner. I've got green beans that I grew, eggs for my chicken is going to be deviled eggs, cucumbers that I grew, and tomatoes that I grew. Can't get much better than homegrown. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you on that next video.